So this is a video about solar storage um, of a battery system. So we basically use solar panels in the daytime to um, charge our batteries and then in the night time the batteries discharge and we obviously have a free electric. Um, good for all those people who want to save money on electric bills and things but the initial outlay is very expensive but it actually is worth it. Um, so we'll start with the solar panels. Um, so as you can see they're all on the roof and um, I can't get the angle but the 16 kilo 16 solar panels here four kilowatts they provide when the sun's shining as you see the blue sky so they are pretty charged up, up. so they're supplying ac voltage and um, down the line so we go back in um, and so So obviously go back in so this is where it comes out so you've got a pv um, inverter there um, which is basically connected to solar panels that can convert the um solar panel energy into 240 volts yeah and which is going into the grid as you can see at the, in the meter yeah um, and obviously um if you look there um you can see the battery um 25 amp um, circuit protector just in case something goes wrong you need this very, it's very important you have this because it's for safety as you can see it's all wired in so you can trace the wires back round from the consumer box um, which is that um, you supply the whole house with electric and that you can ski goes back round to this inverter now this is the inverter here and um, it's converting um, the solar charge basically coming off the roof into battery voltage so you can see there um, it's com it's converting um, the so we got 3.31 kilowatts coming off the solar panels which is that there that left um, icon number one then you can see the grid is zero so we're not using any energy we're, we're basically living free electric you can see the actual consumption of the house which is um 29 kilowatts and you can see there um 3.06 kilowatts are going into the batteries to charge them and um, which is coming right from the um solar panels so basically from the sun we are um, having free electric and um, so this takes about four or five hours to charge and um, but all all depends on how many batteries you have what sort of system you have and the capacity and um, so as you can see there and um, this is where everything the business happens these are the batteries there um very expensive to get um about ten thousand pound investment but um each battery supplies um 3.5 kilowatts and you can see they're connected in a um, parallel to each other and um, this is a obviously a cable that controls like a network cable that controls it and that goes into the inverter so the inverter at the minute is charging the batteries for free um using the sun basically and um, so um in the night time when they're fully charged which will be about seven o'clock british summer time tonight and um, these batteries will be fully charged and um, as you can see um they're on two 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 three lights or two lights they have six lights in total so when they're fully charged they will stop charging and um, obviously and start discharging which means they'll be sending the voltage 240 volts um inverted from this inverter um, into the actual house electric system so basically the idea behind that is that you won't be consuming any electric so in the daytime when the sun's out and um, it's charging the batteries as you can see and um, for free and um, and then there's no draw on the grid as you can see there um, and just point point zero one so zero draw on the on the grid so you can see it go to zero to one here so nothing coming off the outside grid so basically we am um, saving lots of money and um, um, and we can see that the panels are generating 3.3 kilowatts today and um, in the height of summer and um, obviously the panels generate 4 kilowatts which will mean the batteries will charge faster but as you can see they are 3 bars at the minute and when they get the 5 bars they are fully charged and um, typically with a system like this which costs about £10,000 um, you can basically get you know um, up to 16 kilowatts out of them 5 batteries so if you work it out in the daytime, um, a typical house will consume 10 kilowatts, 11 kilowatts. 
you can see it can drive the whole house all night all day with washing machines on such and such kettles on and stuff but all depends on your on your uses and how you use your electric and um, obviously when you start using more than what the batteries can supply um, and if the batteries run out for instance then um, obviously it'll go back to the grid but typically if you've got, if you've got this sort of system we're looking at about 24 hours free electric because in the daytime we're going to charge the batteries to full in the nighttime and um, the batteries will discharge into the house so you know with that sort of system we, we've actually realized that um you know with, with the electric going up in price as well um typically in one day um you can basically have free electric and it'll cost you nothing um, and then you can basically run your tvs your computers your washing machines and stuff like that and dishwasher it's all fine you know um obviously it all depends on the weather if there's no sun outside obviously you're not going to be able to charge the batteries but um you know this is what it is free electric so this is the most energy efficient um use of energy that you can have you know um, but like i say it's a very expensive um outlay but in the end it probably is worth it um so um you know thank you very much for watching my video um any questions let me know any questions about wiring stuff let me know um and obviously um we can go from there um thank you bye bye